Alright, so this is a guide taking MetaTrader 4 and taking its data. Go to Tools History Center, download. It's already selected the instrument I want, the time frame I want, and this is kind of just something I do automatically. I just hit download, I hit export, find the list that looks familiar to me that I'll recognize inside the program of uh, Time and Solutions. So if I were to start from the beginning, I would start Time of Solutions, hit Run, and then I would be able to get inside, I would hit the folder. Uh, I have not yet mastered having it stream in real time. Um, I have the program, uh, the expert, and I have it running. I just uh, haven't been able to get it to take. To stick but this after Sergey's recommendation to hit load which I just did I've been able to get the price data to show relatively easy and converted all etc and then I just hit Q spectrum calculate and then auto select and then you got the Q spectrum and if you want you could add the Bartels on it, it gets a little noisy uh, and you can look for confluence uh, now it's it's rare when they you actually do get confluence uh, most of the time you get divergence like this uh, where it's divergent it's uh, kind of almost opposite uh, so it takes some discretion to determine which one's correct uh, you know <laughs> um, you kind of have to pick and choose based upon the market structure uh, which one to believe and um, I, I almost want to side with Q spectrum until um, the market structure doesn't make sense um, and it's it's even better when they're confluent but uh, that's kind of my mini guide on just A to Z on the intraday cycle um, I also use the the trading spectrum on the smaller time frame just to see what the trading spectrum has to say uh, with the walk forward analysis um, and just kind of its long term cycle um, funny thing is I think March 23rd is the uh, Fed uh, rate hike let's see uh, Forex Factory uh, calendar next week so the 23rd is unemployment claims. So yeah, the, the rate hike decisions, the 22nd. So I mean, technically it's not a bad uh, guess for just the top um, versus the Q Spectrum 2. I don't know, it just looks like uh, it'll be choppy going into the weekend, uh, just speculating. But uh, yeah, I, I think for fast and slow, this is a, like a simple setup and obviously you got your intro week analysis but um, you know this is an art uh, that's using science instruments and uh, using to, to, to find the best probability and it's difficult um, but this is one way to do the intraday analysis